Welcome to another video and this one is for all you chocoholics out there, specifically Cadburyzaholics. Yes, it's the ultimate Cadbury's ice cream. Now to make your custard ice cream base, combine into a pan 500 ml of milk and 300 grams of sugar and gently heat on the hob until all the sugar has dissolved and the milk is just starting to steam. Now be careful not to overheat and to boil the milk as you'll end up with a burnt taste which isn't very pleasant. Now add six egg yolks into a separate bowl or jug and gently temper the eggs by gradually adding spoonfuls of the hot milk and whisking vigorously. Continue to slowly add around five tablespoons of the milk and this technique will gently bring the eggs up to a temperature and prevent the eggs from scrambling when you add them back into the pan. But if in doubt, just keep adding an extra spoonful in before pouring the eggs into the pan. Keep the mixture moving by giving it a good old stir. And now to make your ice cream chocolatey, add 120 grams of Cadbury's dairy milk chocolate and two heaped teaspoons of good quality cocoa powder to your pan. Keep it over your low heat and just keep whisky, 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 melty, 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 stir, 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 you get the picture. Just keep mixing until it coats the back of the spoon and then pour it into a large jug. Here for your visual delight is all the extra goodies we're going to be adding to our ultimate Cadbury's ice cream, including a dark chocolate sauce and Cadbury's fingers and a flake. Next up, pour in 600ml of the double cream, more whiskey, whiskey, whiskey to combine, and that is the epic chocolate ice cream base complete. Pour this silky mixture into your ice cream maker and set it churning. Now we have pre-chilled our ice cream maker for around 20 minutes, so be sure to check if your machine needs pre-chilling beforehand, as some do and some don't. While your ice cream is churning, prep your chosen Cadbury add-ins. As we've said, we've gone for fingers and a flake, but feel free to raid the confectionery aisle at your local store and choose your favorite Cadbury's Chucky Treats. So go ahead and slice and dice these into chunks. And once your ice cream has reached your desired soft serve consistency, ours takes around 20 minutes, lovingly throw in about half of your chocolate chunks into your ice cream mixture. Now we've been a little bit naughty here and we've added in a boozy twist by adding a drizzle of Mozart chocolate cream liqueur. It tastes absolutely amazing, but of course this is optional. But give it another quick go around in the machine and make sure your chocolate chunks are evenly distributed throughout. And give it a compulsory taste test and ooh and ah in the privacy of your kitchen over its epicness. Spoon half into your chosen container and add the rest of your chocolate chunks. Then the rest of your deliciously creamy ice cream and finish off with a generous squirt of dark chocolate sauce and just gently agitate it with a spoon so you get a lovely ribbons of sauce throughout your ice cream. And that's it. Delicious, creamy, decadent, and a perfect way to satisfy any cabaret aholic Thanks for joining us, and if you enjoyed this video, please support our channel by hitting the like and subscribe buttons, and we'll see you next time.